So hey my tater tots, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, as you could probably see by the title and the thumbnail, we have yet another lookbook today. I'm so excited to be doing this video. As you guys may have seen or probably watched, um, I did a back to school lookbook a little, maybe about a week or so ago. And it actually did better than I expected it to do. So I decided to give you guys yet another lookbook and show you some of the outfits that I wore while I was in Cabo. If you have me on some of my other social media, oh well no, even if you don't, well I mean you should. You should regardless, they'll be on the screen and in the intro and the description box for those of y'all that still have not added me on there. But anyways, even if you didn't have me on social media at that time, you still would have saw me on here prepping for vacation and stuff maybe about two, three weeks back. And yeah, I just thought I'd come on here and show you guys some of the outfits that I wore while I was there. And this is actually like good for me too because y'all, I did not, as y'all probably saw, I really didn't get that many pictures while I was out of town, but it is okay because y'all are still gonna get to see these fits today. And if we being honest, more y'all will see it on here than on Instagram anyways. So it all works out. I don't wanna make this intro any longer than it already has been. So just go ahead and add me on my other socials if you haven't done that already. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button and the bell so you never miss when I post a video. And let's get right into the video. But as y'all can see, it's just like this three piece bikini set. Y'all probably saw me haul this in my very first Shein bikini haul. This was, yeah, this was in the first one. If y'all can see my pads, don't worry about that. But yeah, y'all, it's just this three piece bikini with like this sarong, so cute. And y'all, to think that I did not used to like sarongs and now them is like my favorite type of cover ups. Anyways, but yeah, I just wore the three piece set. I probably can't see my shoes, but I just have on these white sandals with it and this clear box bag with nothing in it. So cute. And I also did leave my hair down like this the night up as well because I just felt like it was more like not islandy because Cabo is not even an island, but um, I felt like having my hair all down look better just it just looked better that's all but yeah y'all i absolutely loved this set and then i just have on my gold accessories all over gold trim on my bag gold earrings necklace anklets everything oh i did not show y'all the bag this is what the bag looks like so cute so yeah this was hmm out of the five no, this was definitely not my favorite. Well, no, it might have been. Girl, I don't know, but this was definitely one of my favorites. I'm very glad that my pictures with this one came out right. Because, y'all, you could not tell me. <laughs> you could not tell me that I was not on every at that resort. You could not tell me that. You couldn't. But, no, not even, like, on no insecure type stuff like I, I just felt really good in this I felt like I look good and when you look good you feel good I might be kind of dragging it now because we can definitely move on to the next fit but I just don't want to take this off because like I really did love this one. Oh, but I didn't even tell y'all every night every like pool night had like a theme to it and this is what I had planned to wear for the all white theme if this is how I was coming to the all white theme <laughs> all right y'all let's move on all right y'all so this was my neon fit as you can see i did a little bit more with this one i just have on this neon orange two-piece set with like this ring detailing right in the center so cute y'all probably saw me haul y'all probably saw me haul a lot of these items but anyways i did plan on wearing the cover-up with this one just because I don't know, I just felt like the outfit as a whole looked a lot better with something more than just the two piece. And I really did like how the cover up looked with 
the whole thing all put together. I also did pull my hair up into this high ponytail and then I had these reflective type of glasses that I just felt like complimented the outfit a lot. And then I just have on these gold and nude sandals to just kind of tie everything together with all the gold detailing all around the rest of the outfit. I'm gonna show y'all what out the, ooh, that's bright. Very like simple, but still cute. Y'all know that's like my thing. Then if I wanna be real bougie, I could like drop it like that. One second. But yeah, that's how the outfit looks all together. You can kind of get a feel for it how it would look without the cover up. Personally, I really didn't care for it. I mean, the swimsuit itself is cute, I like it, but I feel like, I don't think this is something that I would wear just by itself. I feel like it looks better with a cover up with it, whether that had been this one or a cute sarong or even like some cute flowy pants. Like, I just feel like this swimsuit is in my opinion, it's not really cutting it by itself. Like, I would definitely want to wear this with something. But yeah, this was my neon fit. I didn't even try to take pictures this night because it was just like one of those, girl, you know what, I ain't gonna lie, I was drunk. I was drunk and I didn't want to even take pictures, but I still wanted to look cute or whatever. And I was cute, I was still cute though because I, I know how to keep it together and I, but my little, Cosmopolitan in hands. <laughs> my peach martini, those are my two go-tos. Just fun that. But yeah, y'all, I really did like this outfit. All right, child, and then this is what I had planned to wear for the pink theme. I did not end up wearing this outfit, but now that I have it back on, I kinda wish I would have wore it. I had the chance to wear it, but I just chose not to. I chose to wear something else, the little backup one that I had. But I just did not feel like wearing this on that particular day because I just felt like it would have been a bit much and it was very hot. I just, I did not wanna feel like I had so much clothes on. But anyways, as you can see, I still just have my hair in this high pony, which is coming down. I have this super duper, very pretty pink, fitted cover up swim dress that I have from Fashion Nova. Um, underneath it, I just put on like this cute white crisscross one piece, which I thought went so well. And then I just have this cute white bag from Ego and these cute white like crocodile print sandals from Ego as well. This is the bag close up, so cute. This is what the bag looks like, so cute. And then I just have on some silver accessories with this outfit just because there's a silver trim in my bag there is a gold trim around my glasses but like i said i mean i'm not that that particular when it's something as small as this and especially when the glasses look as cute as they did with this outfit it's not something i would trip over you could definitely tie up these strings in like a bow or something or tie them some little cute way like i said i didn't even end up wearing mine it still got the little tag on it <laughs> i definitely did not wear this I wish I would have, but like I said, this was for the pink thing that we had. All right, y'all, now this is the outfit that I had planned to wear for the jungle theme night. I just have on this two-piece cow print bikini. Clearly, cow is not like a jungle animal, but I wanted to wear this, and who is really analyzing what print you have on? Like, come on now, clearly it's an animal. But yeah, y'all probably saw this one in my Shein haul as well. The very first one is just this like velvet cow print swimsuit with like these gold chain detailings on them. And then I did pair with this small new bamboo bag. So cute. I have on these gold sandals, just some basic gold sandals that still tie in with the outfit. And then I threw on like this off-white type of dress cover-up. Not even dress, but this is more like a shirt cover-up, right? Girl, I don't know. But anyways, um, I just tossed this on. I don't know about y'all, but when I go on vacation and I plan out like my swimsuit outfits, even if I don't plan on wearing a cover-up with that particular swimsuit, I always like to make sure that I have one with me just in case. You don't know like the setting of things, um, where exactly you're gonna be at and all that other kind of stuff until you actually get there. So you just never know. You might not plan on wearing one, but then you might see where you're at. You might be like, okay, I just, I feel like I wanna throw something else on or I need to put something else on so I'm not just like in my just bare bikini. But I had this one on hand while I was there just in case I wanted to throw it on real quick. 
but y'all while I was there I did not wear this I didn't end up wearing that cover up with this I just wore it just like this that night thus a little bit of the back that's all you get yeah y'all this was another one you could not tell me I was not the sugar honey iced tea in this like I just knew that I was killing the game <laughs> for my favorite swim fit it was between this one and the white one these was my top two not sure if this is one or two I actually found this bag like a few days before I went out of town and I bought it on impulse I don't even know what bag I was gonna wear with this outfit and some of the other ones that I wore this with but I'm so glad I found this because I feel like this just goes so nicely like look at that and yeah like I said this was just my jungle theme fit I was just wearing these by the pool and stuff you know just wearing these by like the little swim up bars and what have you this um yeah this was a look okay y'all and this was just like my backup swim fit like I wasn't planning on wearing this to any theme in particular clearly I could have wore this as a jungle theme I really could have but why would I wear this one and I had the other one I just showed y'all like come on now but yeah this was just like a little backup so cute I actually really like this fit I did not I ended up wearing the one piece I'm gonna show y'all that by itself in a minute like how I actually wore it um, but I did not end up wearing the cover up with it. But this is how I planned on wearing the whole thing. Oh, my glasses. And then I have my glasses. Period. They're a little dirty, but okay. And then, yeah, it's just like this snake skin one piece that like ties all up and stuff. And then I have these black oversized glasses and this black mesh cover up dress with it. Oh, I also have like some gold accessories, which you can probably see. And just some plain white sandals. Like I said, I wasn't even planning on taking pictures in this, but it's still a look as you could see. But yeah, I really did like this one. I really like this, y'all. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna show y'all how I had it, how I actually ended up wearing it. But like I said, this was just like a backup, so I wasn't planning on wearing this anywhere. I just had it as like a just in case. This is it without the cover. This is actually how I ended up wearing it. I did throw on like some little jean shorts that went with one of my other outfits just to wear it down there. But this is how I wore it. I did not end up wearing the cover up. But yeah, y'all, this is the fit. This was just like the backup, like I said. I did end up wearing it though, just because I did not want to wear what I originally had planned to wear. Like not the fit as a whole, but the swimsuit itself is like one of my favorites that I had like this whole summer. I really do like how this fits. I love how it looks. And it's just like different from my other ones because usually they're like solid. This one has a little print to it. And if I didn't say this already, I don't know if y'all know, but I definitely prefer to wear one pieces over two pieces. So this whole thing is just like right up my alley. I actually didn't wear the glasses with it, but this is what it looks like with them. All right, y'all, so this one right here. This was one of my favorites. I looked good in it. I felt good in it. And I just think it was a cute fit overall. Now this fit I originally had planned to wear to the spa. I'm just gonna throw this on to go to the little spa or whatever. Didn't end up going, but I still ended up wearing this one. It was a few outfits that I did not wear. I did still end up wearing this one though, just like it's like a daytime fit, just to have clothes on. But yeah, as you can see, it's just this long tube multicolored dress. It is so cute. I love it. I love how it fits on me. This is the back. And as you can see, I just paired it with this mustard yellow shoulder bag. So cute. These brown, small, like frameless glasses. And then, I don't know if y'all can see my shoes or not, but I just have on these brown sandals with like a twist in the front that I got from Ego. Some gold accessories, gold necklace, gold anklets, gold earrings. Y'all probably can't see too much of that. And yeah, like I said, cute, comfortable, feminine, definitely vacation appropriate. It's like all summertime vacation colors. I have pictures in this. But um, I don't know if I'll post them. All of my pictures, really, except for maybe like one or two, that whole trip were a mess. One more spin. Spin for the girls, and yeah. 
Y'all, I'm sorry, but y'all need to get a close-up on my glasses. And oh, and this is how I wore my hair that day too. I just had it down. A lot of the um, outfits, I had it like in a different style, but I kept it like this because I felt like my hair was cutest with this outfit like all down and with like a little flip over like sad part type of thing going on. All right, y'all, this one, I'm gonna step all the way back so y'all can get the full effect. Come closer so y'all can see everything else. But y'all, this is what I wore to go sailing. We did like this little sunset sail or whatever and this is what I wore there. I just had this multicolor spaghetti strap, very loose fitting like blowy type of tank top. And then I paired it with these cute jean shorts and these green heels. And I did slip on these blue frameless glasses, very last minute. It just ties up in the back. And then like I said, I paired it with these jean shorts and these green heels. And like I said, y'all, I just wore this on a cute little sunset boat ride. It was so nice, so beautiful. I'm mad I don't have pictures in this either because this was probably like one of my favorite looks the whole trip. But needless to say, y'all know what I look like. I was just on a little boat with my mimosa in hand. I was on there having a mild panic attack. But it's okay, because I'm... I'm here to tell the story, so that should let y'all know that everything was all right. Y'all, I don't know about y'all, but this is definitely like my favorite outfit. At least one of them. I'm gonna stand right here so y'all can see the whole thing. I'm gonna try to recenter it like when I edit, but can't make no promises. All right, y'all, and then this was my backup dinner outfit. I did not end up wearing this one, but let me know what y'all think. I'm trying to like scoot over to the side so y'all can see the whole effect of it. Sorry that I'm a little off center, but I'm trying to let y'all see it first before I come up some. But anyways, this is the dress I have on. It's just this multicolor long sleeve dress. So super duper cute. As Soon as I saw this, I just knew it screamed like vacation. I don't know about y'all, but that's what I got from it. And then as you can see, I do have my hair still in this high pony because I think it looks very nice that way. I paired it with these clear heels. And I was thinking about pairing it with these, if you guys watched my last Shein haul, I, I hauled like these blue lace up heels and I thought those would be cute with this, with this white bag. It's a bag like this, it's the same exact bag, but it's white. Matter of fact, I'm gonna check out. So I was gonna wear this with the lace up blue heels and then this bag. I thought it was cute like that, but not like how this one is. Like I said, I didn't end up wearing it no way but in my suitcase i had it packed as this dress with this bag and then the clear heels just because even if i still wore the white bag because i think the white bag would look cute with this but purple is just a little better if you ask me because it really like makes you dive into the colors that's in the dress just the clear heels themselves with them being like low like mule type of heels i think it gives you more like the legs aren't being taken up as much with like, clearly this is a short dress, but once you start lacing the heels up and stuff, it takes away from like your legs. And I don't know, I thought we was giving legs with this outfit, so I didn't want to really take from that. So nice, like I said, this was my backup dinner outfit. I did bring two dinner outfits because I didn't know which one I wanted to wear, but I did end up wearing the other one. I thought the other one was more classy. Like, the other one was definitely more classy, and that's just how I was feeling that particular night. I wanted to be a class act. I mean, don't get me wrong, this is cute and all, but we are not giving class act with this. We're giving, you know, you look nice. <laughs> but child, I don't care. I'm wearing this somewhere. And I would preferably like to wear it with my hair like this, just because I think it looks nice. But even if I don't get to, it's still gonna look cute with whatever hairstyle. I don't know, but I'm gonna make it work because I'm definitely gonna wear this. And I'm definitely gonna take me some pictures. That's what the back looks like, if y'all didn't. Yeah. This was another one of my favorites, but like I said, I did not end up wearing it. But let me know what y'all think about this one. Oh, and y'all, before I forget, I did change my lip color with this outfit. Well, I was planning on it. Clearly, I didn't because I didn't wear it, but I paired it instead of my typical brown glossy lip that I usually do, I paired this one with like this purpley pink type of glossy lip, so cute. I will have details in the description box for under this outfit for my lip combo. But isn't that so pretty? Like, yeah, I should be a lip model. <laughs> All right, child, and then this ended up being my dinner outfit. I absolutely loved this outfit. I'm stepping back so y'all can see. 
Okay, y'all. But this is the dress I ended up wearing. I just have on this one shoulder, hot pink, ruched type of dress. So pretty. I absolutely love this dress. And I did keep my high pony going because I thought it was, I thought this was more of like a classy outfit. So I wanted some type of updo. I really wanted to do like a cute bun, but I have a little too much hair to do a bun without it being like a gigantic and just looking crazy. So I decided to opt for the cute high pony. And as you can see, I do just have on these black lace up heels with like this clear chunky heel on the back and then i have my silver accessories and then i have my black and silver hardware ysl crossbody so cute and of course my signature glossy brown lip yes y'all i love this outfit so much probably one of my favorites out of the ones that i wore throughout the whole trip i did get pictures in this outfit which i'm so happy about but yeah y'all this is so pretty i just felt like a class act with this i thought it was so feminine so classy so pretty i absolutely love this oh and then y'all my tan is starting to like fade a little bit i'm starting to get back lighter this was the last night there so i had by that time i had this dark pretty rich tan oh my goodness it was so pretty you'll see it in my pictures and stuff but y'all it was just so pretty and i absolutely loved this outfit i got so many compliments on it once again and yeah i loved it they loved it everybody loved it like look how this fits y'all so nice i could have did my tie a little bit neater but it's all right all right child and then this is the next fit this is what i wore to go camel riding and atv riding this was another fit that i did not plan on taking pictures in i didn't take pictures in because it's just so simple it's really not much going on with it and I just, I don't know. I felt like I already had so many other pictures I was planning on taking that this was not one that I was gonna go out of my way to make sure I got pictures in. But as y'all can see, I just have on this black one piece type of romper. I have my brown Marc Jacobs crossbody. So cute. I'm so glad I finally got to wear this cause y'all, I bought this in like March. I bought this bag in like March and I just never got to wear it. So I'm glad I found something to put it together with. And I definitely feel like I would get a lot of wear out of this in the fall. Can't wait. I just have on my silver accessories, my Apple Watch, and then my taupe 500 Yeezys. I did have some high white socks to go with this outfit, but when I tried them on, I did not like how it looked. It looked like, I don't know, it made my fit look like so corny i don't even know how to describe it but i did not like how it looked i even tried it on with some black high socks too i'm like let me see if maybe i just need like black no both socks they just i didn't like how the high socks look with this so i just put on some regular ankle socks so yeah just left it like that as y'all can probably see this is definitely my favorite way to style my soft locks so easy out of my face so cute I loved it. But yeah, like I said, this is what I wore to go ATV riding and camera riding. It was all in the same day. And there was not an outfit change in between. So, and that's another reason why I was like, I'm not even going to worry about pictures too much because I more so want to make sure that I have something that I'm comfortable in, something that I can wear to both excursions, something that I'm not burning up hot in because both are outside. And I just, like I said, I still wanted to make sure I look like something. So I just kept it very simple and I just wore this black one piece with this bag and my Yeezys. And y'all, just to throw it out there, y'all, the camel riding was definitely my favorite part of the whole trip. Y'all, it was such, it was so nice. It was such a nice experience. Highly recommend if you have a trip coming up sometime soon or you're just looking for new type of excursions to add to your next vacation so you're not like doing the same thing. Camel riding. All right, y'all, now this might have been my least favorite fit. Well, this, no, this was my least favorite fit of the whole trip, y'all, because my outfit, something happened with the outfit that I was originally supposed to wear the day before I left. So I had to like throw something together real quick. I didn't have time to go get nothing new or nothing like that. So <laughs> it still makes me so mad, but I mean, it's not the end of the world. This is what I scraped up together. I just have this black wrap up top with these distressed fashion over jeans. And then I have my 
Gucci slides on. I decided to throw on these glasses at the last minute to kind of at least give the outfit something else so it wasn't like so, so, so basic. And I thought these were cute. I thought they was cute, period. But the, um, like that purpley maroon color does tie in to my slides a little bit. So I thought that that gave me something. And then, of course, I just have my regular accessories on and I wore this bamboo bag. It's the same bamboo bag from, I forgot what swim outfit. I wore this. I don't know, I wore this with a few of my swim outfits, but I know I wore it with the cow print outfit, but it's the same bag, but it did have a chain that went to it, and I thought the bag looked better as a crossbody with this outfit. But yeah, y'all, I just tied it up like so. This is like my least favorite outfit of the whole lookbook. I did not like this outfit. I already wasn't planning on, well, no. I was planning on taking pictures with the original outfit, but when I, had to like change what I was wearing at the last minute. I was like, okay, well, I am not taking pictures this day. But yeah, I ended up wearing this. We went on like a city tour and it was like a, um, we did like a boat ride and we went to eat and stuff. And you know, we did like little souvenir shop and stuff like that. So it was like a real like simple type of day anyways. It wasn't like too much going on. Yeah, this is what I ended up wearing. Like I said, for the eighth time now, I hated this outfit. I actually got a lot of compliments on my outfit this day, which is crazy because I did not like it one bit, but I did get a lot of compliments on this outfit. But yeah, y'all, I did not like this outfit. <laughs> okay, y'all, and then this is just what I wore to the airport to go home. I kept it very simple, not much to it. I really didn't care like too, too much about, you know, like busting a fit because A, just the airport. B, by this time we're going home, I'm kind of ready to go home, so I really don't care. And C, I just want to make sure that I am comfortable and, you know, that I still, you know, I, I look okay. Like, I'm, I'm not really worried too, too much about being the best dressed in O'Hare. This is what I wore. Now, like I said, this was going home. I'm not going to show y'all what I wore going there because it, it wasn't, like, nothing but i do just have on this black dress from fashion nova i've actually worn this already and like i said i just threw it on again to come home from the airport i actually was planning on wearing a different bag with it i was planning on wearing my uh pink mcm bag the little pouch one but i didn't i already had I was already wearing this bag the night before we went home and I was not about to change parts of this stuff to go home. And this still goes clearly. So I just threw on my black YSL crossbody. Like I said, my hair is still in this high pony. I have my silver accessories on. And then I just got on these black, black and like tan color um, sandals. Cause I'm gonna take them off so y'all can see it better cause y'all can't see with my foot in them. But it's just like this snake skin and then it has a clear strap across them. But yeah, y'all, as y'all can see, it's a very simple fit. Not much going on at all. And yeah, y'all, that's really all there is to this one. So that is all I have for today's video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell so you never miss when I post a video. Make sure to leave me a comment down below and let me know which outfit was your favorite, um, which ones did you like, which ones maybe did you not like, um, what pieces you would substitute for another and maybe one or two of the outfits. Thank you guys once again for watching and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye, y'all.